Good day, good afternoon, good evening, good night, whichever one applies to you. I am Noelle J, and I love helping people accomplish their goals. Today, I wanted to talk about a popular phrase, happy wife, happy life. Have you heard that phrase? I heard it my whole life growing up. You keep the woman happy, life is good, right? But the more I took time to really think about that phrase and just kind of started to dissect it, I've had a lot of questions come up. One, is it true? Is it true that if the wife is happy, life is happy? And is life happy just for the person that's happy, which is the wife? Or does life become happy for the husband? Is life happy for the children too? Or does this happiness only apply to the wife? And then I started to think, well, when we grow up hearing sayings like happy wife, happy life, does that mean that we don't value men's happiness? Do we not value that they have desires, feelings, dreams, goals? Like, is it just, hey, well, if you've got a wife, keep her happy and life will be but is that really true for the men? How does focusing on one person's happiness and not the others truly impact our relationships? Is that maybe why the divorce rate is so high in the US? Because we follow happy wife, happy life belief? And are we, are we following that blindly? Are we actually seeing success with happy wife? happy life. I'm not sure we are. Does that phrase give women like a sense of entitlement or do we, you know, does it give a woman like this, oh, I've got power because all I got to do is, you know, hey, if this doesn't happen, I won't be happy. And once I say that, you know, your life won't be happy unless I'm happy. For men to grow up hearing this, that, well, if you keep your wife happy, life is happy. What message does that send to, to the men? Yeah, your happiness goes on the back burner, dude. You can forget about being happy. But if she's happy, then you're supposed to be happy. But really, does, does that really happen by de default? Are men actually happy when they acquiesce or yield to their woman? Their woman? 100% of the time or 90% of the time is is this actually beneficial and if so who is it benefiting and then when you break it down like Dr. B Sears does and he talks about how happiness is a happening which means it's temporary then whatever happiness is experienced by the wife is temporary temporary so that means it's only a matter of time for you going to have to make her happy again so that life can, quote unquote, be happy for her. Maybe less chaotic for you. How do men feel on the inside when they follow and live by the belief that, well, as long as I keep my wife happy, life is good. And then all the while, their happiness is just out the window. So the question is, does a happy wife actually equal a happy life?